And a warm welcome from North London. We're at the Emirates Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal, and they face Brentford. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Number eight, Martin Odegaard. Number 29, Kai Havertz. Number seven, Mikhail Saka. Number nine, Gabriel Jesus. And number 11. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. A vastly experienced Belgian, Kuhn Castells, will be in goal. Kai Havertz starts with Bukayo Saka on the flanks. And the centrepiece of the attack today is Gabriel Jesus. And here's the starting 11 for Brentford. Lorenzo Pellegrini plays alongside Edison Alvarez in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Thank you, Emirates Stadium. Enjoy the game. Well, this game should offer plenty. Arsenal get it going. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. Keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. And winning it back. Martinelli. Martin Odegaard, now he must favour the cross. Kai Havertz, now the attack fizzled out. Can they forge ahead? They do, and you've got to say they're good value for the lead. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. Back underway. Arsenal with the lead. Pellegrini. Wissa has it. Lorenzo Pellegrini with it. Fofana. Tremendous ball played through. And the snuffing out of the cross there. And over it comes. And did his job defensively. Johan Wiesa. But he knew he had to get to the ball. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace.
just can't get it past the wall. This might be ideal for the counter. And that was a very fine read. Sound piece of goalkeeping. And space to attack. So, a corner here. Favouring the short one. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel. And well, they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Determined defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, a committed challenge. What's the referee going to do about it? Well, only a yellow card, but was there a case for a red one, Stuart? Well, maybe so. I think he's got a bit lucky there. I think he stopped a clear goal-scoring opportunity. Martin Odegaard, they've regained possession. And a good-looking ball. He's in behind. And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. No problems for the keeper. Arsenal have given it away. Bofana. Martin Odegaard. It's with Erdegaard. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Bukayo Saka. And it's Gabriel Jesus. It's with Erdogan. And there to intervene. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. A wonderful intervention. White. Well, the half-time interval fast approaching. It's Arsenal with the lead. And a good point, I think, Stuart, to get your critique of their performance so far. Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. And a Brentford throw in. Todibo. A good effective pressure high up the pitch. Arsenal have given it away. Routine, really. Gabriel Jesus. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. 
Well, if only he had timed his run slightly better. Offside. Gabriel Jesus. Fractionally offside. Three minutes of added time here. David Hansko. Wissa has it. Back to Pellegrini. It's got to be! And he's gone and scored to level it again! Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. And time is up as far as the first half is concerned here at the Emirates. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, it was a vital goal and at a crucial time, you have to say. Certainly changes the complexion of the game now, but it's whether they can take the momentum into the second half as they've struggled at times today. And the contest begins. Can they forge ahead? So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Arsenal's free kick here. Havertz. White. Moving into the advanced position. And he's got the beating of his opponent. And clears the danger. And they just let his opponent glide by. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. So there we have it. 2-1. Can he find the right pass? Keeper had work to do. And the short option preferred. Might be onto something with that ball. Havertz. Really vital interception here.
Ikoma Luis Openda. Jesus. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Openda. Moving forward effectively. Will they get themselves level here? Not out of the woods yet. Can he open the door to a potential goal? And the keeper more than equal to it. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Elects to go short. Fofana. Determined defending. Jesus. Oh, he's given the ball away. Keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Interception to snuff out the danger. Jorginho. And do they mean business on this occasion? Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Martinelli. Magnificent defending. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Breaking at pace. Now oh, that's a super ball over the top. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Happy birthday to Alex O'Neill celebrating today from all of your friends and family. Gabriel Jesus. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Alexander Zinchenko. Substitution for Brentford. Coming off the pitch, number three. Rico Henry to be replaced by number 27. Long way out. Well, no surprise to see him go for goal, but a routine save in the end. An example of how to press. Openda. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Oh, well, maybe the equaliser. No shortage of excitement, level again, no wonder they're excited. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. Well, back underway here, and they've split the four goals between them so far. Well, he's gone back to give the free kick, the referee here. He tried to play advantage, but it didn't accrue. And time for the change now. And deep into the penalty area. Well, still an issue here. And that is going to be a free kick.
substitution for Alessio. Coming off the pitch, number 29, Kyle Havlitz. To be replaced by number 19, Leandro Trossard. Really good challenge. Five minutes of the 90 still to go, and the teams cannot be separated. And crossing towards the far post. Well, it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. Vitali Janelt. Well, they're certainly thinking about a winner. Well, hit with power and almost the right precision. And they will make the change now. Lorenzo Pellegrini coming onto the pitch. Number 22, Kiernan Dewsbury Hall. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. It will be very instructive to see how Arsenal respond to that setback. Jorginho, now in possession, Trossard, Martin Odegaard, Trossard, it's with Odegaard, Arsenal have given it away, Openda, that's useful play. And still looking for space. And a no-nonsense clearance. Determined defending. So the final whistle now. And disappointment for Arsenal, you've got to say. A defeat for them. Your assessment? Yes, Derek. It was a tight game between two very good sides. But they lost concentration late on. And it's cost them dearly. They'll need to get over that quickly. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's put in a really authoritative performance here. Yeah, I think the only thing you could question, could he have been a touch more clinical in front of goal? Maybe should have had two or three today. Regardless of that, it was a good performance and a great result. And a good-looking ball.